Hello, Xavier here. Welcome back to another Pokemon Essentials video. And today we're going to be working on the Panika Town Part 2. Now, I've already completed it, so that's why I'm here in Route 1, so that way you guys can't see it. But it is very, very, uh, very, it's, it's finalized, basically. I'm very satisfied with it. Uh, I'll be changing the gym later on. I didn't want to change it during these videos because I didn't want to spoil what typing it is. Uh, it's pretty obvious with the you know with the town, but what well, well, you you guys will see at, at at the demo and stuff. Uh, but yeah, um, it turned out pretty well. I changed a lot of stuff, and then there's a lot of stuff that I tweaked. I added a little bit more tiles. I changed a few tiles just so I can add some more stuff, and I added some uh, buildings to it. So let's go check out that speed speed run. All right, speed time lapse. There you go, <laughs> time lapse. I'll see you guys there.
my guys, as you can see, I am now complete with it, and I am very satisfied with how it looks. The top, very good. I put a lot of uh, trees, a lot of bushes I added, as well as some trees. As you can see, I went back and forth, back and forth to what I needed to change and what I wanted to go for. Uh, the top area did seem a little bit brown, more brown, so everything was kind of blended in together. I might, might change this right here, uh, the, the house, to green here as well. Uh, might as well do it now, but like, uh, just wanted to make sure that it isn't too. Let me zoom in a little bit more. Is it isn't too? Uh, how do I say it? Too brown. I didn't want it too brown because you know it'll look so weird and contrasting to what it really is. So there you go. I think that adds a little bit extra. There you go. So yeah, as you can see, I've changed up a little bit stuff. I wanted to make it feel like it is in the mountainside, you know, so I made sure that it was like you're going up and there's, you know, the, the rocks and then there's some, there's some grass and stuff. So yeah, this is my final product. Hopefully you guys like how it is. I am very satisfied with it. And as you can see, I did change the, uh, the regular road. I darkened it a bit and I made it to this. I took out some of the green bits that made it look like there was grass there. So that way... I can, you know, it can, it can be more aesthetically pleasing. So, yeah, uh, let me know what you guys think. This is the final lizing of this town, uh, besides the NPCs and stuff like that. But, yeah, guys, thank you guys for watching today's episode of Pokemon Essentials. This town is now complete. Now, the next video, it'll be finalizing some of the other routes. And I have some ideas with the Punica Forest, since I do have some more tiles that I found. Um, where's they at? specifically where is it at i'm pretty sure there you go specifically these right here which are going to be really cool to use uh but yeah uh so i'm going to be finalizing a lot of routes most of it was just rough sketch i still haven't found anything for the caves but i i do have to keep searching for that and uh yeah now it's just kind of finalizing the first few routes and then after that we'll be working on some of the NPCs and the Pokemons stuff like that and uh, then we'll be testing out the game and seeing how it turns out so I'll see you guys in the next video see ya